Yo, what's up my Sinus Soldiers? It's Typhlosion Explosion here. And welcome back to part 29 of our Pokemon Lunar Dark Let's Play. In the last episode, we finally made it to Coralite Town. And we also withdrew a Weir Tide we're hide from the PC at last when we started using him. And in this episode, we're gonna finish taking on the trainers in the battle, uh, battle, what it was called? Cafe, I think it was called. And make our way to the lighthouse because, on apparently, according to Rick, there's like a really strong trainer on the top. And if I could actually move and get in, that would be nice. So let's finish taking off on these trainers. Oh, double battle. Okay, I see you. Margaret and Wayne. Rush shot and let whoa that's a cool okay this is does not look like a match for my boy our boy our boy uh pixelily let's hope he could take we could take out legend next time i think you could take that yeah we could take it oh bug buzz just does a ton but we're gonna get some health back with the leftovers let's go and crunch and let's use bug buzz come on you gotta take this bro credit credit crit legend x oh no poor oh dang it pixel lily you almost had it bro but you couldn't but at last you were no match for for the power that that was uh power that was legend x sorry i just blanked out for a second and we're gonna finish with quick attack. It's gonna use overheat. That's a bit overkill. Jeez. Calm down, bro. We're gonna use brine. Throw some salt in that wound. Because you just took an L. 40 for Warehide. Let's go. Now Warehide finally cowed off with the rest of the Prudixy and Pool Dog. So let's use. What? I just got this weird command pop up. I don't even know what it was, to be honest. I don't know. I'm 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 a little confused. Okay, what? Huh? Okay, this is weird. Forty for South Slam. Okay, it just keeps coming up. Hold on. It's not letting me attack with... Hold on. It's not letting me attack with Salisan. Okay, I need to hold on. There's something always going wrong. I swear, with every time I try playing this game, there's always something going wrong. I just have that bad luck, I guess. Hold on, I'm gonna check this out after we're done with this battle. That was weird. Hold on, guys. I will be right back once again. Okay, I'm back. I'm gonna try this again. And if it doesn't work, then I will... I don't know. I don't know what I'll do, actually, to be honest. I'll look it up, I guess. Hold on, let me just try one... I just wanna see now if I had to just relaunch it. Maybe it was just... For some reason crashing i swear it's like i'm the only one who ever faces these problems <laughs> Jeez. okay let's go back now and take on our trainer and hopefully the same thing won't happen it was like it wouldn't let me attack with sal slam because every time i don't know okay now another double battle let's hope this works better can we just battle these guys? Okay, that's weird. So I guess we gotta retake on, take them on again, huh? Okay, that's interesting. Shoot. Well, we're gonna use bulldoze, and that's gonna not affect uh, Legendix, but that will. We'll be able to take on Rush Shot. Okay. We're gonna get some health back with the leftovers. So I guess we gotta re-take these guys on. 
Let's use Rock Slide. Okay, that's it's doing it again. Maybe it's just these trainers specifically that this is happening with. Well, we have Rock Slide. That'll just take it out. They'll do a lot. They don't take it out though. That's surprising. What's going on? Okay, we take on let we take out Legendix. So I don't know if it's just these trainers, or is the game just breaking on me? I hope it's not like a big thing. Oh my god, this is annoying. This won't. It's like it's like no one else can battle except. This Pokemon. I think it's I think it's the trainer that's just glitched. I think something's going on with like the code for this trainer. I don't know. Well, are you serious? I didn't even take it out. Come on. It's annoying because it's like every time else it was like Okay, let's finish this with Bulldoze and now hopefully it will work. I think it's just this train. These trainers were just glitched out. It's weird. Let's take on this girl, and hopefully it works again. This is your boyfriend. He looks a lot younger than you. Grenatric and Flare Hair. Interesting names you got there. Ruby Op will definitely go for Bulldoze. Okay, I think it's just it was just that the, those trainers were just glitched or something. Actually, that was not smart for me, because now Scorpion is going to take a lot of damage. But it will take out Grenade Netric, because it's not- it didn't take it out. Isn't it Fire Electric? Damn, it's just bulkier than I thought. Scorpion is going to take a lot, though. Flare Hair. Flare Hair also takes a lot. It's going to use Thunder Wave, but we switched to the right Pokemon. I think it was just those trains were glitched. I don't even think it was our computer. I think it was just- they they had the the code was like messed up. I mean, as you, as you guys can obviously tell, I am not a programmer. I want to make a Pokemon game, but I just don't know if I could because I'm afraid since Pokemon's going on like a witch hunt. Oh, it's not a fire type for any uh Pokemon fan game. So and I don't want mine to get taken down or get even like like have to go to court or something or get like into big trouble because Pokemon does not like fan games. Pixelate is going to grow to level 40 though, that's good. We're going to use Rock Slide, it's going to hit nothing. Whoa. It's this thing's evolution. Um, Let's use Brick Break. And let's use, actually, 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 what I'll do is I'm going to heal up with Ruby Op. Hopefully we won't get a burn. And I'll have... Use flamethrower because that will be the best. It hits, it hits everyone, but it's super effective. Don't get burned. Well, of course you get burned. But whenever I hit everyone else, they're not gonna get burned. Watch. Yeah, of course, right? Are you serious? Come on. We're gonna take that though. Uh, you need to... Do I have a full restore? I have a couple of full restore. I'll use a full restore on you. I'll, and I'll heal you up. These two are not good together. Because they just don't have... A, their moves don't have synergy together. Jeez. Let's heal up. Let's use Magnet Rise. But weren't you already a flying type? That's kind of an inconvenient move. Cross Poison. Okay, Ruby Op. We'll have Ruby Op use... Brick break on you, and we will use. Let's just use lava plume again. I don't really know what else we could really hit it with. Oh, we got hit with the iron barbs. Jeez, this thing has iron. Okay, that's level forty for Scorpionip. Please don't get burned again. Okay, there we go. That's almost a one shot. If only we got a burn, that would be even better. Um, and we'll have Ruby Op finish with Brick Break. Good job. I hope I didn't, it didn't select, uh, okay, there we go. Oh, man. I still don't buy that you guys are a couple. He looks way young, way younger than you. And that is not okay. 
put Petrival up first. And I might actually make this a longer episode. I feel like I'm I'm I feel I'm feeling in the mood for a longer episode. I was one of your first turn of battles. Can you remember me? Yo, so this guy, he's an OG. We battled him a long time ago, and now he's coming back. Oh yeah, Stickwig. Stickwig, so I definitely have battled this guy. I mean I did battle a lot of stickwigs in the beginning, so I don't know if I remember you, but I think I do. We're gonna flinch him with rock slide though. Things have not changed, and we're gonna still kick your butt. It's so good when it's so nice to see like when Pokemon games add these like like trainers you battled already into the game and they're like, oh hey, do you remember me? I bat we battled before. And it's just like a nice homage, and it's like you it shows that other trainers you battled, they they go also train and evolve their Pokemon. They go on, they become stronger, and you and it's nice to see them again. It's just it's just a cool little it's like a nice little touch. I like I like it when Pokemon games do that. It just it's just a nice little nod. It kind of expands the world a little more too. It shows that other trainers go on and become stronger, so it's good. I like it. I like the idea. I think Pokemon game, real Pokemon games, should start doing more of that. Things still haven't changed, buddy. I still beat you. And just in case, if this is a, there is a future. Yeah, I think we beat everyone in this. Be and everyone here. Hey, do you want to? I want to battle this guy. I'd rather battle you, dude. Waiter Stewie. Is that a pun? Is this a ground water type? I, I think it's a ground water type. Well, yeah, it's ground water type. Okay. Well, that's interesting. Let's use water pulse. Let's try using drill pack. That one probably won't do a lot, but. Okay, that didn't do a lot. We should probably switch. Rock water. Okay, I well, ground water, I mean. We don't have a grass type. But let's send out. Let's use Salad Slam. Salad Slam could do a good job. Actually, that was not smart because this thing's a ground type. S Oops, that was probably a dumb mistake on my part. Surf. We just summon a giant wave that just like washes everyone. Which is like just gets everyone wet in the cafe. Just imagine. That's that'd be that'd be insane. Pokemon are are very interesting creatures. Don't hate yourself. Come on. Don't hate yourself with confusion. There we go. Body slam. You just jump. You crush that uh plata, whatever it's called. Monstrap. Uh Monstrap is oh yeah, we're this good we're good against this thing. This thing's a never mind, I was thinking of of the sand dune Pokemon. I forgot its name. We should have really sent it in Pixel Lily. I think it's called Mons Dude. Maybe that's why I was getting their names mixed up. But anyway, Pixel Lily can just use Bug Buzz. And you know, it's so good that Pi uh, Pixel Lily is still so good in this game. I, I'm i glad because Pixel Lily's. He was here and I was afraid that I'd have to replace him. He's really good. I'm just a, I'm just a waiter, not a good trainer. Nah, you were okay, dude. You were good. You did a good job, bro. You put up a fight, and that's what I can respect you for. Okay, let's go heal up our team. And just heal up the squad, and let's go to Lighthouse. I think I might just try to complete the Lighthouse, unless there's not do. Depends. If there's like a lot of trainers, then I could just try to complete the Lighthouse in this episode. Because I'm feeling a longer episode, I'm telling you. Just taking our time and enjoying this game. Because soon, actually, we will be coming to an end, unfortunately, which is something I'm kind of disappointed with. I mean, it won't be an end permanently, because obviously this game isn't finished, so I will come back. But there will be a couple more episodes, and eventually, he's a lighthouse expert. There's a Bill, Bill's lighthouse in Kanto, the glitter lighthouse in Alvin Jodo, there's a lighthouse in Slateport, Hoenn, and in Sunny Shore Sinnoh. In Drifail Unova and Co in Drifail Unova and Comarine Kals, you could find also find lighthouse. Oh, I think I'm pretty sure in a yeah, I'm pretty sure you couldn't go in those lighthouses in in Kanto and in Kals and Unova. On the highest floor of the lighthouse, there's a man with the name Beacon. Oh my God, that's such a bad name. 
He always wanted to be a gym leader, and he didn't get a license, so this lighthouse is like a gym. If you don't get a badge, if you don't get a badge if you beat him. Okay, that's pretty cool. Now, how do I get up? Huh, how do I get up and, like, am I missing something? Dude, where is he? Poor light lighthouse. Hmm? I'm confused. Okay, it's, yeah, I want to try it out, but how do I get up? What? <coughs> sorry guys, I ca sorry if I coughed, uh... How do I get up there? What the heck? Hold on. Dude. Am I being stupid? I... No, I remember a YouTuber I watched, he was also struggling on how to get up here. Let me, let me, I gotta check something out. Be right back. Okay guys, I'm back. This cannot be any less obvious. It's right here, and I'm pretty sure I went through that and it wasn't working. Yo, this guy's got a Petrovol. Hold on. And I don't know if I can finish it in this episode, because this kind of looks long. You know what, let's have a Petrovol versus Petrovol matchoff. My Petrovol is stronger. Yeah, there we go. That did a lot, actually, surprisingly. I'm telling you, our Petrovol is really strong. Petrovol is just a strong Pokemon jack. Oh, he's gonna Volt Switch right out here, coward. See? But that's a pretty- It's got another Petrovolt? It's got more than one Petrovolt? What? What? That's crazy. It's gonna use double team. Oh man, this Fire Blast is not gonna hit now. It still hits? Let's go. Petrovolt is strong, bro. He doesn't take anything. He's like, I have the best Petrovolt around. Fear my Petrovolt. It is the king Pet of Petrovolt. I don't know, I just- I love this Pokemon. Level 41. Damn it. 100 special attack. Let's go. This guy ha got his lights conked right out. Double trouble battle. Well, you... Um, Emily and Amelia. Of course their parents would name them with rhyming names. Okay. My uh, two strongest Pokemon right here. Or my two... My two main Pokemon. Oh, come on. Another double battle where it glitches out like that. Let's use Drill Peck. That's gonna do a lot. Gonna use Leaf Tornado, that's gonna miss. Or use Poison Tail, that's gonna take it out. Cause this thing's a fairy type. Almost takes it out, let's go. Okay, I are you serious? Come on. It's really doing that again. Phone went off again. Cause it heard the name. We take him out, let's go. We defeat the twins, double lose. It's double loss. So correct so educate yourself, bro. Let's put Salas Slam. Let's give my boy Salas Slam some slamming time. Okay, that sounds actually really weird. I'm telling you, that was so like not obvious. Like you couldn't even see that. And I'm pretty sure I went into that like little opening. Cause I'm like, that was a little suspicious. How the room indent a little bit. Poison Tail. I think now, I think next level is when he'll learn, like, Poison Jab. I think it's 41. I'm pretty sure, at least. Please be 41? Damn it. When does it learn Poison Jab? Is it, is it, like, 44, maybe? I don't remember. Time to put my studies to use. Well, it's not always about whoever knows the most. Sometimes it's a little bit of skill. Locky. This kid's parents hate him. He has the best name, Locky. 10 out of 10. Great name who, who would want to name their child Locky? probably the best probably the smartest most loving parents would let's use bug buzz it's gonna use damn this this little bulldog is faster damn pixel is a bit slow now but i like how we have the leftovers though that's really good let's just finish with side beam and this thing's just gonna keep using bow beam it, it's like it's like uh the drool is water, which is disgusting. Just, ugh. Scorpionip. Okay, this is a match. This is a job for Salislam. Actually, we could have had a 
We could have had a Scorpion versus Scorpion face off. Let's use Surf. That's gonna take it out. It is dead. It is not dead. 40, almost 42. Eclipser. So it's the, I know I remember what this thing is. Let's use Wear Hide because this is perfect for Wear Hide. Whoa. That's just gonna one shot. That's, there's no way that's gonna live. Cool looking Pokemon though. It lived a little bit. So I guess it's a Rock Psychic type? Probably is. But we're still faster, even though it used Rock Polish. I like its cry. It's kind of adorable. School Kid Locky. Oh no, I need to study more. <laughs> it's not always about studies, like I said. Sometimes you just don't. You just have that, that natural talent. All natural. Since I don't want Wear High to hurt itself, get hurt. Let's put Pixelily and. And wear hide together. See, let's see how they work as a, as a duo. Let's just check this out. The last floor of the before the lighthouse keeper thing could be me. Oh, that's the last floor. Never mind. So we could finish this in the lighthouse in this episode. Okay, that's fine. I was I was worried that there'd be like a lot to do. So there's a ruby op and a peak p flock. Well. Let's use Dazzling Gleam on the Rubyop, and let's use Crunch on the P Flock. I, I was about to say their names kind of rhyme, but actually I don't think they do. They just sound like they would work together. Why would you have a Dark type right here, but you use it on the Pokemon doubly resist fighting moves? Yes, AI, that is very smart. Dazzling Gleam is just gonna take that Rubyop right out, like bop it. It's gonna use Arrow Blast. Jeez, it has Arrow Blast, but Pixely's living. Pixley, you are the best, man. It's gonna use Platybill. <laughs> Platybill. Such a funny name. Let's heal up with, uh... Use a Max Potion to heal up. And we will use Crunch. I'm, I like how the... I like that the health bar doesn't individually, like, slowly go up when you heal. Because that's kind of annoying to look at, watch after a while. Goes water pulse, jeez. We take that pretty well. Kobolta. Oh, I I like this. Po I love this Pokemon. This Pokemon is just like, just one of the coolest Pokemon ever. I want an electric snake Pokemon. That's like a really, electric's my favorite uh, type, and snakes are my favorite animal. So, the two of them together would just be so perfect. This thing's really cool looking. That did a lot though. <laughs> Maybe if I ever do a second playthrough of this. This thing has the- oh, it has the Aqua Ring. I was about to say, this thing has the leftovers. This guy's actually being competitive. I really hope that, uh, where I learns a new- a better move soon because... Or we find a better TM because it's kind of annoying to keep using Crunch. Okay, it learns- wants to learn Moonlight. That's something. I'll take it over how We could heal it ourselves up. I was hoping for something a little more offensive, but I'm not going to complain. We're going to keep healing up with the leftovers. This Aqua Ring is going to keep do healing it. And let's just use Psy Beam. But, well, let's just finish it with Quick Attack. Nice. I know this thing learned Extreme Speed, but I don't know if it lear can learn it now because we evolved it. So you win. So close. Ooh, it looks like this dude. He lo it's the final trainer right here. But, you know, let's put uh, Werehide up first. Give Werehide some love. It looks like a rich dude. Ah, uh, you made it all the way to the top. Congratulations. Now let me introduce myself. I'm Beacon, the lighthouse keeper. I look after this lighthouse and I make sure that everything keeps running so the light doesn't go out. I also love to battle my spare time. And since you made it to the top, we can battle. Are you ready? Go. So this guy's kind of like a gym leader. Except without a, jet, without a badge, or not a, and without a cool intro music. Whoa! Bold voice. This thing's a rock round type. Okay, rock round. So let's send in my boy, Salus. Actually, let's send in Rubyop. Let's give Rubyop some love. We haven't really used Rubyop in this episode. Let's use Iron Head, jeez. Let's use Brick Break to break through that rock hard shell. Good, good, a good chunk. Let's use Magnitude. It's gonna, use, it's gonna use the highest magnitude. That's gonna hurt right there. It's gonna withdraw. Ooh, this guy pulling out the strats. Whoa. This thing's a 
Oh, this is Sharko's evolution. But it almost just dies in one hit, so that was not the smartest plan right there. It's got speed, but it goes for Screech instead. That was not another smart play. I cry, though. Leganix, I know what this thing is. It's that uh, water flying type. Actually, let's end Scorpionip, because Scorpionip has a rock slide. Let's use just... It's gonna use Wing Attack, just slaps us in the face with its wing. And this is four times too... It's four times weak to it, so this will just do... This will just take it out. There's no way it would have lived that. Let's go. Good job, Scorpionip. Bulldoze. Um, let's finish this up with Ruby Up. Give it a nice one, two. Despite having two rock types on the two ground types on the team, it hasn't really been that bad for us. I was kind of worried that we'd have a lot of problems, but no, we're we're fine. Rose level forty one. Scary, scary eerie. So this is a ghost type. Let's end aware hide because he's a dark type. Okay. Whoa, this is a cast spooks evolution. Oh wait, this thing's just a rock ghost dark type. That's still gonna do a lot though, but it's gonna disable us with cursed body. Okay, let's finish this with fate attack. It's gonna use shadow ball. That's nothing. It's gonna lower special defense, but we we are gonna finish it up with fate attack. Good job, where hide. And we defeat the lighthouse keeper beacon. Wow, you have amazing skills. Congratulations on the win. That was that was a tough battle for your effort. I award you this. Okay, it gives us fly. It's not a gym badge, but it'll work. This is the HMO2 fly. You can use it to fly to every city you have visited already. Great battle, Lunar. I hope we can battle again someday. And I hope we can battle again someday too. If you guys like this video, please leave a like and subscribe to become a Cinder Soldier. Anyways, I'll see you guys next episode. Peace out.